Meeting minutes are used for managing the topics, invitations, and notes for your meetings. Using the meeting minutes utility, you can create a series of related meetings and carry forward any outstanding topics to the next meeting as needed. To access the meeting minutes utility from your project dashboard, click on the document control tab in the left panel. Then select meeting minutes from the document control options. The meeting minutes main page will open, displaying all of the meeting minutes on your project. You can sort and group the meeting minutes as needed. And if you like this presentation, you can save it as a default view. You can use the search and filter panel on the right to show only the meeting minutes that you want to see. You may need to click on an expansion arrow to open up a group of meeting minutes. And then to open a meeting minutes record, simply click on its tile or line. The meeting minutes record will open, and the first thing to notice is the red banner across the top indicating that the record is locked and cannot be updated. This is because the status of the meeting minutes record has been set to completed. If the record was in draft, open, or scheduled status, these fields would be editable. The topics of the meeting and their details are listed in the grid and you can click on the expansion arrow to see additional details of any topic. Additional information regarding the meeting is displayed in the right panel, including the attendees. Click on the blue button to create and schedule the next meeting of this type. This will open a new meeting minutes form and carry forward any open meeting items, as is the case here with the parking passes. To create a new meeting minutes record from the meeting minutes main page, click on the plus button in the upper right of the screen. The create meeting window will open, where you must first select a meeting name, enter the purpose of the meeting, and select a meeting location. The date will default to the current date, but can be changed. Enter a start time and end time. When you have reviewed your entries and selections, click Create. The details page for your new meeting minutes will open, with summary information in the right panel. To add topics for the meeting, click Add and a new line will open in the grid below. Select a topic from the drop down and enter a description. The rest of the information on that line will default, but can be edited. Create additional topics as needed. Add action items to a topic if necessary using the blue plus button, which will open multiple detail fields in the right panel. More on this in a moment. Add attendees to the meeting. and send invitations to the meeting attendees. Once attendees are added and invitations sent, the status will change to scheduled. Click Save and or Done to return to the Meeting Minutes main page or click Create Next Meeting to open a new meeting form and carry forward any open meeting items. After the meeting takes place, you will want to update the meeting minutes. If topics are covered in the meeting, you can change their status to closed. If a topic is not resolved, you can change its status to in progress or leave it open. Based on this, you may want to create an action item, which will open action item detail fields in the right panel. Here you'll want to enter a subject, select a type, and choose an assignee. Add a description, 
and then save the action item, or save and add another if necessary. This action item can now be managed in the Action Items Utility. Please see the Action Items lesson in this course. Also, remember that detailed notes with text formatting, such as font, bolding, italics, and even bullet lists, can be added to any Meeting Minutes topic. The Meeting Minutes record will now be updated, showing that the topic linked to the action item is in progress. When the action item is completed, you can mark the topic as closed, at which time you may also want to mark the entire Meeting Minutes status as completed. You can also create the next meeting based on this record, which will carry over the invitees and any open topics.